Hello, class. Can you hear me? Hello, hello. Hello, teacher. Hi, Hanada. How are you? Fine, thank you. And you? I'm okay, thank you. Alba. Giovanni Miguel. Hi, Welcome. teacher. Hello. Is it raining in San Miguel? No, it's hot. No. In San Salvador, in some parts, it's raining. Really? Wow. Yes. Yes. But it's still hot. Mm. Yeah. Amen. So, Alba, uh, the um, carnival this year in San Miguel is going to be virtual. Yep. <laughs> Actually, for the Queens, Queens, mm -hmm. right? Yes. It, it was a private event and they just transmit by Facebook and be just that it was oh. virtual. How boring. Yep. <laughs> yeah, it's boring. And that, that is a very good business that day for San Miguel, right? Yeah. A big business, but with this, with this pand pandemic, pandemia, how mm -hmm. do you say? Pandemia. With this pandemia, it, it's not the same, obviously, right? And so, I think everywhere. Yeah. Yes. But the carnival is a big, big business. Okay, let me see something here. Let me check one thing here, hold on. Who is watching TV? Some, okay. Let me see here, let me check one thing. Sorry, uh, I am visiting some friends. No, no problem, no problem. I want to check this here, hold on. Remember yesterday we were talking about, good evening, we were talking about customs. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> do you see? Yes, you, teacher. Okay. Unique. You. Unique, uh, yes, and unique too. <clears throat> do you see my, my um, screen? Yes. 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 Yeah. All right, cool. It says workplace customs. Now, these are customs of work. Okay, so listen what it says here. Uh, if your company is moving to another country or your job requires you to meet with partners all over the world, it may be worth your while to learn more about what 
to expect when you reach your destination. Workplace customs can um, They can vary from country to country and the smallest misstep could complicate your potential business dealing. <clears throat> For example, listen, in France, since personal relationships are just as important as business connections, many officers begin the day with everyone shaking hands. So imagine in France, when you go to the office, you shake everybody's hand. What about here in El Salvador? What do you do? You just say. <laughs> What's up, man? What's up? Que onda? Nice. <laughs> Benite goma. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, in France, I guess. So if you go to France to work someday, you have to shake people's hands. United Arab Emirates. It says, in the United Arab Emirates, the left hand is seen as unclean. Ensure that you offer your right hand for handshakes and never touch important documents or food with the left hand. Can you imagine that? Well, I think actually all the Arabs, all those Arabs, they don't like the left hand. They say the left hand is only for the bathroom. Yes, teacher, I know that. These are disgusting customs. Yes. So imagine if you give something to a, an Arabic Arab with a left hand, you are insulting that person. Crazy people. Very crazy people. Can you imagine in El Salvador? Tenga, con izquierda no, ah, pues coma mucha. <laughs> you know, our culture, we, 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 we don't care. Okay, let me see. Can you read this Hong Kong? Can you read that, Gustavo, please? Sitting placement are tied to sen seniority. The senior executive in the room shall be offered a seat at the head of the table during the during any meeting. Okay. Do you understand? Yeah. How, is that the similar here in El Salvador? Mm. Yeah, it's similar. Mm. The boss always sit at hell. Well, at work, in my case. Yes. Happens, but. So, yeah, because in this case, it's talking about senior executive, not a senior citizen. Yeah. <clears throat> so it's the metal metal, right? The boss, man. The boss boss. Now we have Italy, let's see. Alba, can you read Italy, please? Okay. Italian people often have two business cards, one for business situations and one with personal information for social gatherings. <laughs> can you imagine that? <laughs> wow. <laughs> You have a card for business and one for pleasure. Wow. <laughs> what, 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 men, what would you think if a woman gives you a card with her phone number, 
her email and everything. What what would you think? Really, really, what would you think? It's her her own boss. Yeah. Some people maybe you think she's a prostitute. Yes, could be. Yeah, maybe because it's not that women don't do that here, but in Italy it's okay. So in Italy it's okay for a woman to give you her card with her phone number and all her information. So that's interesting. All right. Carmen Lisette, can you read in Japan, please? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Well, I, tr I try because I am not in dry, but in moving. Oh, you're moving? Oh, okay. So, no, yes. Yeah, no problem. Then, then okay. No, then, then, oh, then just listen. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Yeah, Thank no, you. no problem. Thank you for telling me. Giovanni Garcia, can you read Japan? Yes. Good evening. Yes. Okay. Japan. Uh, Japanese business people view the business card as an item of importance. If you are offered a business card in Japan, you should take it with both hands and take a moment to study the information before putting it away. Okay, do you understand? So if you are in Japan and somebody gives you a business card, take the things with two hands y demostrar interés, show interest, like, oh, okay, nice, nice, thank you. Imagine, okay, Giovanni Garcia, oh, okay. <laughs> El mero loco de la esquina arroba gmail.com oh ok that's your email ok, okay. <laughs> it's a good partner yes it's like I have a friend um, his brother the big brother his name is Fito pero le decían Wara Wara because he had a nose so his little brother le decían Periquito and that's his name, Perico. The funny part is that now he is a professional lawyer and, and everything. And he gave me his business card. I'm all, thank you, Alex Marin, abogado, notariado, no sé qué. Correo, perico, 1182, arroba, gmail.com. No, no, Perico, no. Why, what? You can't put this on your business card. This is not professional. Pero así el de siempre. Yes, but now invent. You know, licenciado marín or, you know, something, you know, licenciado notariado marín or, or. But you can't put. It looks very professional in the Gmail. El perico 1182 <laughs> gmail .com. Oh, no. <laughs> so, no, it's not correct. All right, Japan. Let's see. Argentina. Now a woman's turn. Norma Natarin. Can you read in Argentina, please? Okay. Hello, Argentina. Yes. The business launch, the business launch is not popular in Argentina. Most business related meals. Business related. A business related meals happen at dinner, which start around 9 p.m. Wow. Can you imagine that? Um, do, you have, do you have executive lunch? Do you have business lunch here in your office, in your work? Yes, teacher, but before yes. the pandemic. Oh, OK. Yes. And usually you go like to a restaurant, right? With 
the executives. So in Argentina, no, in Argentina's dinner. And at 9 p.m., can you imagine? Here, I don't think it's a very good idea because imagine, Carmen, your husband, hey, donde vas? Oh, I'm going to a business-related lunch, dinner. What? Dinner? Why not lunch? Oh, because they are from Argentina. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's do Taiwan. Henaro, can you read Taiwan, please? Yes, teacher. Taiwan. Yo soy lo, yo, eh, excuse me. Yo soy, soy bring gifts. Bring gifts. Bring gifts to get finish business associated in Taiwan. But they be prepared for the gears to be rejected. Rejected. To or rejected. 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 To or rejected. To or three times. Two. Before it I'm sorry. It's two or three times. Two or three times before it is accepted. Okay, good. So what do you understand? If you go to Taiwan, what should you do? Imagine if you go to Taiwan for business, what do you need to do? Bring a lot of gifts. Bring gifts. And will they accept it? No. 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 It is rejected for two or three times. Yes. I can imagine. Here, this is for you. Oh, no, no, thank you. No, really. No, no, thank you. No, really. Bye, pues. Teacher. Give. Yes, no. In our mm -hmm. company, we, 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 we have to reject always. But there is not a, like a limit of, of a gift. No, no, no. We have to reject because it's an ethic. It is, yes, it can be a conflict, Policies. conflict of interest. Yes, yeah. that's right. <clears throat> no, but, but like, look, Giovanni said, Giovanni said, what kind of gifts? For example, look, yo, I used to work in Google, in Google. And, um, we, we did that, we cannot accept gifts unless it's very like, the 50 dollars para abajo, it's okay. Okay. For example, in Google, we could not give uh, a customer or associate, we can't give them a laptop or something expensive. But like Giovanni said, if you go to Taiwan and you take a un lapicero that says El Salvador, I don't think that's, Yes, but you have to report it to human resource to accept. Oh, okay. For example, in my company, it's not allowed. It's taking as a bribe. That's a bribe, okay. Okay. Yes, see, I'm a conflict of interest. That's right, yes. Yes. Yeah. It's true. Okay. Pero nosotros no, cuando venían los de Google y nos daban todas esas cosas. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, man. Man, me daba, like, los Comcasts. Man, like, I got maybe 20 Comcasts. You're lucky. Yeah, because well, but it was in, in our case, it was it, it, uh, with the intro, you know, it's like every time somebody from Google, they just here, here. All right, uh, let me see. Da, 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 do, 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 do. Maria Stella, can you read something in the United Kingdom? Okay, United Kingdom workers in the United Kingdom spend the most time 
on a computer or working in any nation, followed by, by the United States of America. Wow, can you imagine that? United Kingdom, these are the people that spend the most time in front of a computer. Wow, that's a very... <laughs> Melissa Trujillo, can you read Nigeria, please? Melissa Trujillo is not there. Can you hear me? Yes, now I can. Okay. Nigeria, Nigeria business uh, people. Uh, I'm sorry, it's called Nigeria. Nigeria, okay. Mm -hmm. Nigeria business people may ask each other about personal matters and families during business meetings. This is done to show uh, warm and friendship and it is important to respond. Okay. Is that allowed in El Salvador? Um, is the question, please. Is that is that normal in El Salvador? So, Melissa, do you work? No. Um. Yes. Are you married? Um. Acompañado. <laughs> Oh, you have a boyfriend. You live with your boyfriend. Yes. How long have you yes. lived with him? What? How long have you lived with him? Um, six years. Six years. I think. Wow. I think. <laughs> do, do you love no, him? Teacher. Do you love him? Um, I'm sorry, Melissa. Look. I'm, I'm just, I'm, no, wait, wait, let me, don't, don't answer. What I'm doing is that in El Salvador, that's really. No. Yes, you don't say that in a business, como like. Maybe, maybe only, how was your family in general, but not yes. a personal question. Yes, imagine, Melissa, imagine I am your boss. O lo estoy entrevistando para un trabajo. That's, <laughs> that's maybe uncomfortable, uh -huh. right? Incomodo. Lo que le mm -hmm. yeah. Because you can say <laughs> in El Salvador, you can say, excuse me, and you sort of tiene que ver con. No, you answer. <laughs> so in El Salvador, really, it's not correct to ask about personal business. Pero pasa. It happens, yes. Mm -hmm. hey, hey, Carmen, Carmen Lisette. Yes, teacher. You work in human resources, correct? No, right now, no. I am an uh, internal resource. resource. Mm. Is it, is it, okay. Una pregunta estupida, right? Adios, gracias. If a woman in my, in my work, imagine I am her boss. Y si yo le digo, mire mi amor, necesito que me haga un favor. Necesito que me haga este reporte, este reporte. Como le dije, mi amor. That's considered. That's... <laughs> acoso, teacher. Acoso. Yes. Usted right. no trabaja no. en mi empresa. Somebody can. Uh, can. Y log on. Um... Okay, good. Yes. Be no, and I understand because it's not correct. What if I kiss her? <gasps> no, teacher. This worse. Yes. You can't kiss people at work, correct? No, you can. Okay, because <laughs> you simply know the recursos humanos de que dan todas las reglas. Do, do, no, do, do. And they're always kissing people. Oh, hola. Hi. That's not. Why? I don't think it's good to kiss. It's not good to kiss. All right. So, good. En El Salvador, no hay que ser metidos. Lo que yo le estaba haciendo a Melissa es considerado acoso. Yes. It is. Huh? Okay. Yes. Um, 
some if if someone or Melissa is disgusting. You sound like an android. Section, mm -hmm. She can claim for yes. Oh, okay. Good. Okay, Melissa. So tomorrow in the morning, ponga me queja. Hmm. Okay. Amonestación. <laughs> yes. The teacher was harassing me. He was asking me about my personal life. <laughs> okay, um, let me see. Okay. <laughs> Dan, Dan, can you read about Egypt, please? Hi, teacher. Hello. Can you read about Egypt? Okay. Egypt. In the Egypt, Bosnia, Bosnia, Medin Irish never should have left. For Friday, which is the considered on the day of the rest. Okay, <clears throat> number one. Nice. Business. Repeat. Business. Good. Um, number two. Scheduled. 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 Schedule. 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 Uh huh. Do you know what schedule is? Horario. Horario. Uh -huh. So imagine in Egypt, you never schedule meetings for Friday. Is considered a day of for rest. <laughs> nice, it's, very nice. Yeah. <laughs> and it's about Fridays, all the all the schedule, all the meetings. Yeah. Con hora de salir y hay uno que no se cae en un meeting, huh? Like you know. Teacher, in our company, we have to try the uh, get meeting in Friday afternoon, but you can do an appointment during the morning. We try. Okay. I have a question, Carmen. In Avianca, can a person dress transsexual? How, teacher? Um, for example, a long time ago, I had one student. His name is, what's his name? Oh my God, I forgot his name. Saul, Paul, something. But of course, um, he was gay and he was in the process of becoming a woman. Douglas is his name. And um, so I, I remember he came to class as a man, but eventually he started coming as a woman, as a woman, as a woman. And now, many years later, lo tengo on Facebook, he's a woman. Oh, sorry, he, um, he dresses like a woman. So my question is, in lo legal en un trabajo. I, I'm happy for him porque hay empresas de que ya están mente abiertas y que bien por él. Pero voy a lo legal. My, my question is, what happens if, because he is a man, but he is a, he's a woman, so he dresses like a woman. So it's illegal for the company to discriminate, correct? Yes, but we have a dress code and behavior code too. Yes, we have to try to be accord the meeting or accord the 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 job. Yes, inside the 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 the, the office we have to go according the the police. To the Dewey. 
What? You have to go. I mean, vale. you have to go according to the Dewey. Dewey. To the document. Yes. So for, yes, for, yes, for, yes. for example, yes. for example, imagine my student Douglas. He's a man, but he dresses like a woman. If he works in Avianca, Avianca would tell him, okay, no problem. But in Avianca, you dress like a man or you have to dress like a woman. Yes, we have to address code, right? Right, so you can go, for example, with a drag queen, for example. No, you no, 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 to... no. He, he dressed like an executive woman. I don't know, teacher, because in El Salvador is, is yes. maybe uh, it's not norm, uh, it's, it's not general. Behavior. It's not, yes. It's, um, this is the only case, el único caso que yo sé de esto, you know that. Uh, y él trabaja en RIA. RIA is a call center. Ah, okay. Yes, so, because if you are in in Santa Elena or at the airport, you have to go according the policies. Oh, okay. Uh, but you know, good, good for him, good for Douglas because he has a job and, you know, and yeah, I'm happy for him. Her, her, him, her. <laughs> okay, good. So, you know, um, I, I, think, I think El Salvador really respects the laws. Avianca, I imagine they respect the law. Yes, 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 yes. Yeah. Ya no existen esos jefes que mal, maltrataban a la gente, ¿no? Lo invito a conocer mi trabajo. Oh, really? <laughs> sí. We no. have to try to stay in uh, the best company in El Salvador. Yes. Yes, it's true. It's true. Okay, so those are customs. So, personally, I don't like the custom of Nigeria. I think the custom of no me gusta el de Nigeria. And Taiwan, <laughs> I didn't like Taiwan. Argentina, I like. <laughs> Japan, Japan is very respectful. Another custom in El Salvador that is very different. In El Salvador, if you invite, you pay, correct? Yeah. In other countries, no, if you invite, you pay your part. All right. My, my part. Yes. In other countries. Yes. In the United States, for example, if somebody tells you, hey, Maria Stella, what are you doing? Nothing. Let's go. Let's go drink some coffee. Vamos, pues. Let's go. But when you go, then I go, la cuenta, please. Okay. Okay, my part, Maria, is $8, and your part is $12. And you're like, what? Sí, es que usted pidió esto y esto y esto. Really? <laughs> yes. But in Salvador, no, if I invite you, I pay. All right. So let me put this away. Remember when we were doing used to? <clears throat> Do you remember when we were doing used to? Yes, teacher. Thank you. Here are the three forms of used to. Number one, I used to. Things that happened in the past, but not anymore. You are setting something. 
at the screen. Oh, yes. No, 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 ven. No. Oh, I'm sorry. No, no, teacher. no, teacher. Thank you for telling me. Hold on. Today I saw Lorena Peña. Man, she's ugly. Is she? Lorena Peña. Oh. Ah, I, I remember. I That's remember. <laughs> I remember. Yeah. Man, she's a very ugly woman. <laughs> she's smart. She's smart. Yes, but oh man, she's ugly. Okay. Do you see this? Used to? Yes, teacher. Thank you. Okay, we have here used to. Let me change the. So let's do. I'll go with pink. Pink is one of my favorite colors. Okay, we have used to. Things that happened in the past, but not anymore. But things that happened. But remember, these things happened more than one time. They happened in the past frequently or occasionally. Okay. So things that used to have, for example, I used to play tennis. Can you tell me something you used to play, Genaro? I, I used to play soccer. I used to play soccer. Giovanni, tell me something you used to do when you were a little boy. I used to swim in the trapiche. In the what? Trapiche. It's a uh, pool in Chalchuapa. Oh, okay, okay. Trapiche. Yeah. Is that, like, is that like a Nahuatl name or something? No. Okay. So, yeah, algo como caliche, el trapiche. <laughs> All right, next. Gustavo. Yeah. Tell me something you used to believe when you were a little kid and now you don't. Um, let me see. Oh, when I was here, I used to believe the moon followed me wherever I want. Okay. You used to believe the moon followed you. Yeah. I, oh. I when I uh, was going on, I stay watching the moon and think the moon was following me. Okay, good. Yeah, me too. I think I used to believe the moon was following me. <laughs> Did you used to believe in Santa Claus? Uh, no. You never believed in Santa Claus? I have never believed in Santa Claus. Really? Never, never, never? Never, never. Why? Because... Um, on my family, we have the costumes like gifts, gifts, gifts for Christmas. Oh, you don't give gifts? No. Oh, okay. I love Santa Claus. Ahorita, ahorita tengo mi hijo de pelo, man. <laughs> <laughs> With Santa Claus. I teach him, look, this is Santa Claus. If you're a good boy, Santa Claus will come. Que <laughs> querés? Kick it is, but yeah, okay, Santa Claus. David wants a tablet. What? What? Okay, David, you have to be good. Yeah, you tengo. 
voy a aprovechar ese año o dos. Mm. <risa> uh -huh. And when he's bad, I call Santa. Mm -hmm. Hello, okay. Santa. Yeah. Con que estoy esperando encontrarme un Santa en un mall o algo así para grabar un video. <risa> Yeah. Hey, Santa, dame un favor, can you record? Oh, oh David, si te portas mal, no te voy. <laughs> you know, so I can record that video and show it to my, to my, to my son. All right. So, okay. So, what is used to something you did in the past? Frequently, habitually, occasionally, but now you don't. Next, we have be used to. Used to, I used to as yo solía. Be used to, I am used to as yo suelo. So remember in this, I am used to. Look, let me see. Uh, For example, I am used to hearing the radio listening in the morning. Listen the listening the radio in the morning. Yes. But remember, one, one important thing here is that the verb is always in past. In, 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 I'm sorry, in yeah. ing. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. so, yeah. so look, I am you. What the hell? I am you. Prefiero, saben que es mil veces mejor el, 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 el G, el, el, el. Google Meets. So look, I am used to waking up early. So uh, Carmen Lee said she's used to listening to the radio in the morning. Lo que suele hacer. Yes. Can you tell me something you are used to doing every night, Melissa? Can you repeat, please, teacher? Yes. Can you tell me something you are used to doing every night? I be used to. I am used to. I I am I am mm -hmm. used to. Uh huh. Oh, okay. And I am used to thinking uh some for my son. I'm sorry, I am used to what? Singing? Uh-huh. A song for my son. Okay, very good. So I'm used to singing to my son. Okay, singing to my son. Okay, good. What do you sing? Uh, Estrellita. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, I, I thought you sing maybe Metallica or something. He loves, no, he loves this song. This is his favorite song. Oh, okay, good. Okay, good. My son likes the Smashing Pumpkins. What is this? It's a rock group. Um, he I likes the Red, Red Hot Chili Peppers. He likes David Bowie. David hey, Shark? No, you know, yeah, yeah, yes, cierto que lo que dicen de que. Because that's the music I listen to. You know, I put. Red Hot Chili Peppers, I put U2, I put music. And sometimes when I'm driving and I put music, he says, esa papa, esa. Really, really? You like Smashing Pumpkins? Yes, papa, yes. I'm going to you that. Like, oh, thank, you. <laughs> thank you. Because imagine el día que me diga, esa papa, y el reggaeton, it's like, uh, I open the door and out. <clears throat> Yes. 
Okay, very good. So you're used to singing to your son. Yes? Yes. Okay. Um, what about you, Maria Stella Varela? What are you doing? What are you used to doing every morning before you go to work? I am used to praying every morning. Praying. Yeah. Good. Every morning before I go every to morning. work. Okay, very good. Nice. Good for you. All right. Uh, I am used to checking, checking my car every day before I go to work. You know, check the tires, check it's okay. All right. What about you, Giovanni? What are you used to doing when you are alone? Um, when I usually stay alone, I used to listening rock music. I like in Metallica, Red Hot Chili Peppers, Corn. This 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 type of music. Okay, good. Do you like Nirvana? Yeah. Mm, good. All right, cool. You know, I saw Nirvana in concert. Oh, okay. Yeah, me di el lujo de eso. It was a crazy concert. All right. So we understand I am used to, right? That's present tense. Gustavo, do you drink tequila? I have drink tequila. Do you drink tequila? Not uh, currently, not actually, but I have tried. Okay, do you drink beer? Not usually. Okay, but when you drink beer, what are you used to drinking? Uh, I used to drink Regia. Thank you, thank you. Please don't say golden light. What? <laughs> uh, uh, the no. smell is not it's not too too offensive. I don't like beer because uh, how do you say uh, amargo? Bitter. Okay, but but uh, the wow. flavor and the smell. Yeah. I like but, I I like strong strong drinks. Entonces I like Regia. There's a there's a beer I recommend to you. Se llama Presidente. It's from Dominican Republic. Yeah, I have it's, tried to, but it, it's strong. It's strong, yes. It's but strong, if you if you drink one or three, it's not offensive. But it's, it's not like golden, like Pilsner. It's it's offensive. It's so. No, Pilsner maybe, but. Golden Light, y por Dios, han sacado una Golden Light extra. O sea, puede ser más ligera esa cosa. Impossible. Yeah. Sometimes when I go to the store and I see and I see men drinking Golden Light extra, boy, yeah, man, me dan ganas de atropellarlos. Like, really, man, you're drinking Golden Light extra? Don't drink. Don't drink. <laughs> es como tomar Diet Coke. Don't drink. <laughs> no, but I'm not saying para emborracharte. I'm just saying the beer. Beer, because Regia is good. Um, you know what? I am used to drinking beer in a glass. The jar. And yes, I can't drink beer from the bottle. <laughs> yeah. Siempre. Yeah. yeah. Teacher, yes. did you go to Casa Cucu? Yes, it's very nice. I like it. Yes, yes. The the big <laughs> jars. And that, they have a different flavor too of beers. Yes. Salt and little. No, and they have very, very strong beer. One time I drank three beers and I was 
I was a little happy. I was, whoa, whoa. whoa. That's like, cool. It was very nice. The food is good. But it's expensive. <laughs> it's expensive. <clears throat> okay, so we understand I am used to, correct? That's present tense. Okay, for example, I love coffee, I drink coffee, and I am used to drinking my coffee strong. Fuerte. I am used to drinking my coffee, 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 no instant coffee. I have a problem with, with my wife. Because when I cook, the egg, my wife likes her egg extremely white, 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 white. So she's used to eating her egg white. Y la llama dura. It's very difficult because, you know... <clears throat> If not, no se lo come. So um, she's used to eating her eggs white. If not, she doesn't eat. So what I do is, I'll do the rest, but you do your eggs. Because she's used to eating white eggs. Yes. What about you, Alba? Are you there? Yes, I'm here. <laughs> Alba, is there a moment in the day that you are alone? Um, no. <laughs> no way. <laughs> yeah. You have two children or one? One. Adam. One. Oh, okay. Yeah. She is four, no? No, two. Oh, she's, she two. Is two. Yes. Okay, she walks now. Yeah. Okay. I'm used to playing with her every night. Okay. Is your house baby proof? Mm. No, really. I don't get it. Baby proof, because now your baby walks. So now yeah. you your house is baby proof. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is. Okay, good. Yeah, so, okay. All right, class. And then the last part of used to is get used to. What is the difference of I am used to and I need to get used to? I am getting used to. What is the difference? In the be used to is like something. I'm sorry. What is the difference between I am used to and I'm getting used to? And get to yes is a future. No. Get used to it's something I that we are starting. Oh, we don't do frequently like we used to. Okay, so yes, when you say I am getting used to, it's a process. Yep. It's it's a change. The change, the process of the change. <clears throat> Is the process of the change. For example, Alba, your daughter, she is two. Yes. Maybe next year, or I don't know. Yeah, simple said pampers, right? Yes. Okay. There's going to be a time that she's not going to use pampers. Yep. Or maybe uh, three, four pampers a day. There will be a time that only one pamper a day. So that process 
is getting used to. Okay. So you can say, for example, imagine your, your daughter in this moment, she's in that process of, okay, now I, she understands the bathroom and the pamper, the bathroom and the pamper. So she says she's getting used to going to the bathroom. Yes, in El Salvador, yes. one year ago, everybody, we went to a process. Yes. yes. What did we have to get used to? We got used to the to living with the pandemic. Yes, we had to get used to using masks. Yep. We had to get used to uh, using alcohol. We have we we get used to taking the third vaccination. Oh yes, we had to get used to that. Mm -hmm. Do you remember going to the supermarket? Man, wow. those, those lines, the cola is like, wow. Go out your your house by doing number. Yes, we had to get used to. Y nos tuvimos que acostumbrar porque se nos impuso, fue algo legal en el mundo, right? O sea, we had to get used to. Yes. How is the example in, in, in Spanish, teacher? Okay, for example, look. One year ago in El Salvador, we had to get used to using masks. Hace un año en Salvador nos tuvimos que acostumbrar a usar máscaras. Fue un proceso, right? Becoming. De acostumbrarse a. Pero entonces no es a futuro, es algo que sucedió y que nos tuvimos que acostumbrar. Uh -huh. Yes. Uh -huh. Pero también puede ser presente, lo que el ejemplo de Alba, si su hija está en el proceso ahorita del pamper al baño, Alba puede decir es que se está acostumbrando a ir al baño. Entonces ahí puede ser present continuous. She is getting used to going to the bathroom. Okay. We have uh, used to take distance. Yeah, we're getting used to taking distance. Um, una tía mía, mi tío se murió hace como cuatro meses, bien feo, está cepillando. Y de repente, boom, bam, he died. He died. Y tenía setenta y pico de años y estuvo, estaban casados desde los 17 años. Imagine that. Beautiful, beautiful marriage. Um, una pareja linda o sea, él, él hasta su último día recuerdo que íbamos a, 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 al, a un restaurante y le jalaba la silla para que ella se sentara y le daba el menú Can you imagine it? hasta mal me caía porque nos hacía ver a todos los hombres de la familia mal como <ríe> como shit y, y oh, here baby man mi esposa, man, no jodan. Pero, suddenly, my uncle died. And everybody says, mi tía se va a morir, man. Because it was only them two. Los dos hijos están en Europa. Like, hey. So, the process is now, she is getting used to live without him alone alone okay yeah just start costumbrando no option right 
So she's getting used to. And it's very difficult. Imagine all your life and now. And she is it's, alone. He's mm -hmm. for introducing a, a process. Exactly. That's okay. what it's. Yes, that's what it says here. Look. Look, it says. We are in a process of becoming. I'm sorry, man. Estamos en el proceso de convertirnos o acostumbrarnos a. Eso es getting used to. Les voy a dar un perfecto ejemplo. Cuando ustedes cortaron con su primer amor. Con el que pensaron de que sin él o ella no iban a poder vivir o seguir. Bla, 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 bla. Lo hicieron. But that process is como, oh man, I'm getting used to. Remember when you have a boyfriend for many years or a girlfriend for many, many years and you finish? It's like, wow, yo, ¿qué hago, man? <laughs> like, todo domingo pasado con ellos. It's a process. So you, you're getting used to normal again, the reality. Si mi hijo me dice, papá, me gusta la selecta, ay, hijo, te vas a tener que acostumbrar a, a que siempre van a perder, le voy a decir. <laughs> oh, son, get used to, they're all, they will always lose. <clears throat> so it's a process, right? Mm -hmm. En El Salvador, we're getting used to Estamos acostumbrando a a new government, a totally, ah, totally ah. different government, totally. Mm -hmm. Because it was, it, remember, it was always oh, arena, oh, arena, oh, arena, oh, arena, oh, arena, but now it's a total different one. So we are adapting. We like it or we don't, but it's a process. It's in a, we have to adapt. Yes, eso es I am getting used to. Eh, yo he visto eso en casos como en personas diabéticas. Que les cuesta mucho dejar lo dulce, el pan dulce o frescos o el azúcar. Pero really que lo tienen que cut. Y les pregunta uno, hey, how are you? Man, it's difficult, but I am getting used to not eating sugar. Yes. Do you understand? Mm. Yes, yes, it's yes, yeah. yes. Yeah. Yes. When, when you get married, remember, you lived in your house with your mother and father forever. And now when you get married, it's different. It's a different process. So you have to get married. I'm sorry, you have to get used to your new life. Cuando no empieza un trabajo nuevo, ella está hablando, ah, por ahí. I'm getting used to it now. Se usa mucho getting used to. It's the same I'm getting used to? Uh-huh. As I get used to. Or uh, I will get used to. Oh, yes. I will get used to as you're predicting the future. Mm -hmm. Okay. So imagine you are in a new position. And I ask you, Carmen, how is your new position? Do you understand? No. I will get used uh -huh. to knowing. Yes. So you process. get. Uh -huh. Exactly. You tell me in this moment, David, it's difficult, but I will get used to it. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Okay, class, I hope you have a very good weekend, okay? I will see you Monday. Okay, thank okay. you. Great, thank you. Goodbye, teacher. Thank bye you. Bye, teacher. Have a nice weekend. Thank you, goodbye, you too. Everyone. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye.